I didn't want to go. Revelations from Cole Palmer about his unceremonious departure from Manchester City to Chelsea. Imagine being a kid from Manchester and all you've ever dreamt about was playing football at Manchester City. He lived it and breathed it, then he was shown the door. But he's making them regret that decision. Let's kick it off. Cole Palmer was born on May 6, 2002 in Manchester, England. He began turning heads at a young age. While in Manchester City's academy, he led the under-18s and they won big. Even Pep Guardiola can't help but notice him. Suddenly, Cole was playing under the bright lights in front of tens of thousands of fans, scoring left, right and centre. Cole wasn't just a flash in the pan, he was a bona fide star from the get-go. He captains the under-18 team, scores on his debut for England's under-21 team in 2021, and helps England snag the 2023 UEFA European Under-21 Championship. He's not just another player, he's a rising star. But playing time was hard to come by and for Cole to continue developing, he knew he needed it. Here's the situation. Imagine you're a talented soccer player at Manchester City, you're eager to play, but the competition's intense. Recently, the team's been in the headlines for some major changes. They lost key players like Gundogan and Mahrez. Gundogan moved to Barcelona, lifting City's first Champions League trophy as his farewell. Mahrez, after contributing significantly to City's success, joined Al Ali in the Saudi League. Now, think about the young talents waiting for their chance. For example, Julian Alvarez. Last season, he spent a lot of time on the bench, despite being an amazing player. He's hoping for more playing time this season, especially with the departures of Gundogan and Mahrez. But a football team is always evolving and changing, and Manchester City was no different. They continued to bring in highly rated players to shore up weaknesses and make up for departures. This too created a logjam and clogged the path to more playing time. While Cole Palmer desired more playing time, he was beginning to see that his path may have to take him away from Etihad Stadium. However, he didn't want to leave his boyhood club, so he settled on asking for a loan deal. The city bosses would have none of it, telling Palmer that he either stays and fights for his place or he leaves. With playing time looking less and less likely, Cole decided to move to Chelsea for £54 million for his opportunity. Cole Palmer's journey to Chelsea marks a fresh chapter in his career. Not only did he have to settle into life in a new city, but he also had to get used to new teammates and the style of Chelsea's boss, Mauricio Pochettino. Full of optimism, Palmer set his sights on the starting 11, keen to show what he's really capable of on the pitch. And guess what? He has been sensational. Under the guidance of Bonchettino, Cole Palmer's emerged as a standout player in the Premier League. His skill in finding the back of the net and setting up goals is undeniable. For instance, his performance in Chelsea's 1-0 win over Fulham was remarkable. Not only did he successfully convert a penalty, but his outstanding assist to Raheem Sterling was a highlight of the match. His ability to deliver precise and effective passes has been a consistent feature of his gameplay. Despite Chelsea's overall struggles, Palmer's contributions, which include scoring nine goals so far this season, clearly demonstrate his value and impact on the field. Manchester City, Palmer's old team, seems to have mixed feelings about his move. While they're proud of him, there's a bit of regret too. City's coach, Pep Guardiola, praised his play for Chelsea, but stopped short of saying they miss him. Pointing out other talented players in their youth academy, such as Oscar Bob, who can replace Palmer. But that doesn't deter the fact that Cole Palmer's skills have been on full display this season, and he's taking full advantage of the opportunities it offers. At the under-21 Euros, Palmer really showed his skill, scoring and setting up goals during big moments of important games. His standout performance in the semi-finals proved he's a rising star and just buzzing to take over the football world. Now, people are saying maybe Palmer needed a bit more swagger to shine in tough games. This success has not only made up for a frustrating last year, but has also put him in the limelight for the upcoming season. 
Palmer's move to Chelsea seems to have paid off, especially with his call-up to England senior squad. Under Pochettino, he's been amazing, scoring key penalties and such. Making it to the England team is a big deal for him, showing how much he's grown. His path from City's youth team to a main player at Chelsea and now playing for England is pretty impressive, showing his grit and ability to adapt. Fans and folks who love football have been keeping an eye on Palmer's story, sharing their thoughts online. His journey is a mix of talent, grabbing the right chances and making smart moves. It's really caught the attention of the football world. Cole Palmer's road ahead in football could take a few different turns. One idea is he might go back to Manchester City later on, especially if he keeps getting better and gaining more experience. A loan period, like what other young players have done, could really help with this. Think about how Mason Mount got better when he was on loan at Derby with Frank Lampard. He got to play a lot, which really helped him grow. Palmer could do something like that, getting lots of playtime to sharpen his skills and then return to Manchester City as an even better player. On the other hand, Palmer could keep doing well at a different club, like how he's shining now at Chelsea. Under Mauricio Pochettino, he's been amazing, scoring 8 goals and setting up 4 in just 16 games. This shows he might make a big impact somewhere other than Manchester City. Palmer's choices and how his career goes could also affect how Manchester City deals with their young players in the future. His situation shows how clubs need to balance bringing up young talent and fitting them into a really competitive main team. But there's more to Cole than just football. It's about family, dreams and turning challenges into triumphs. Cole Palmer's really got a great backing at home. His dad, Jermaine, who used to play football himself and now fix his dental equipment, has been like a personal coach to him. They'd spend lots of time practicing in parks no matter the weather. Jermaine's the one who saw Cole's talent and pushed him to be his best. Then there's his mum, Janet. She's been the rock, always there to support him and keep him on track. She's moved around a lot just to make sure Cole could focus on his football dreams. But Cole is not an only child. He has siblings, Hallie, Nathan and Josh, and they're all super supportive too. Nathan, who's got his fancy master's degree in strength and conditioning, flies in from Sydney to hang out with Cole when he can. Josh, who lives in Manchester, like Cole, is often seen chilling with his brothers. And Hallie, Cole's younger sister, is studying fashion design and has started her own clothing brand. She's a big fan of her brother and cheers him on all the way. This family, they're really close-knit. They all play their part in keeping Cole grounded and focused. It's pretty clear that Cole's success isn't just about his talent. It's also about the amazing support he gets from his family. Cole's story is really like a journey. It's about making choices, grabbing chances, and sometimes taking a different path to get to where you want to be. Whether it's staying and fighting for a spot at a big club or going somewhere else to get more time on the field, each decision can change a player's path. And for someone like Palmer, who's got loads of skill and ambition, these decisions are super important. They're not just about getting better at football. They're about figuring out where he can make the biggest splash, where he can really show what he's capable of. Now, we're turning it over to you. What are your thoughts on Palmer's performance this season? Can he become a football legend? Share your views, forecasts and insights in the comments below. We're excited to read them. Enjoyed this video? Then don't hold back your support. Smash that subscribe button, give us a like and ring the notification bell. Stay updated with all our latest football content. Craving more football stories and analysis? Check out our other videos right here. Loads of thrilling content awaits you. Until our next meeting, keep your love for football alive and see ya on the pitch.